everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey what's up i'm jamie i'm so happy you guys stopped by i'd absolutely love if you hit the like and subscribe button and stuck around for my future videos today we are going to go through all of what i got in this makeup bag at a makeup sale for ten dollars you stuff the whole bag you pay ten dollars for the bag anything you can fit in it was fair game if you want to see what i got stick around Every single day I'm gonna make something great That's my way Every single day I'm gonna make something great That's my, that's my way Okay, so I happened to be scrolling one day and saw like in those Facebook like garage sale posts, whatever, a group that I was in, that this lady was having a makeup sale. So I was checking it out. She had pictures on there of like different bins, like shoe bins, like totes, little totes um, of different makeups that she had. She had quite piles, like big piles of certain products. Um, and I saw products from the drugstore and of course Ulta because NYX is sold at Ulta that I was kind of interested in. And it said, all you can stuff in a bag for $10. So, of course, I was thinking maybe Dave would ride with me. He was not having it. So I messaged my friends from work, and Olivia ended up messaging me back, and she said she would go with me. So we were like, well, what, is, what size is this bag? Is it like a grocery bag, a plastic bag, what? And the lady said it was a lunch size bag. Well, in my head, I was thinking the brown paper bags that you take for lunch. But um, when we got there, it was actually this size, which is still is not too bad. It's a little smaller than I thought. But it was, it was awesome because in my head, the way I was thinking was drugstore stuff is getting kind of outrageously expensive. And just one thing can cost $10. So I thought if I could get like five things even in this bag for $10, I'd be making out great. Well, I pushed this poor bag to its limits. <laughs> so we are just going to get right into it. The first thing I put in my bag was the L'Oreal Brow Stylus Prep and Shape Pro Kit. This is 386 light to medium. Looks like this. So it says it comes with tweezers, an angled brush, and a spoolie brush. I'm just going to open it up and we are going to swatch all these because I haven't done that. I wanted to open them with you guys. So I literally, it took everything I had. I kind of had to hide them on myself and forget about them. <laughs> so it looks like this. Let's see what this baby looks like. Okay, so it has a powder and then it has like a colored wax. This is what it looks like. It comes, it's a little darker in person. And then it has the tweezers and on one end is the angled brush and a spoolie. So not bad. Um, I have been trying to get some lighter products, like lighter browns, to for my eyebrows because I feel like I'm going too dark. I don't know. We shall see. We will figure it out. The next thing I got was a Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick in Cherry Pink. This is what it looks like. We're going to rip it open. Thank God I have some sort of nails right now because usually I chop off my nails because I don't want to um, like scrape up the kids at work because that would be terrible. So I just cut off all of my nails. Ooh, that's a pretty color. Very, very pretty. It looks like you just ate a cherry popsicle. So I'm excited to try that. The next thing I got was a L'Oreal Paris True Match Lumi Cushion 
It says Buildable Luminous Foundation. I have not tried mine yet, of course, because I wanted to do this with you guys. But my friend Olivia got one, and she wore it on Friday, I do believe. Looked gorgeous on her. So this is color light, light ivory. Couldn't see. I don't have my glasses on. So you open it up. There's a mirror. There's one of these little doohickeys. Then you flip it open here. You peel this back. And that's the product. So I'm just going to... Oh, it's it kind of feels like mousse. Like, I don't know. It feels like a sponge with product on it. So we are going to put a swatch right there. I think that's going to match me pretty good. I'm so bad about... I mean, I know the colors, obviously. Light Ivory sounds like it's going to match me. When you've never used a product before, you're not sure how it'll work out. But that definitely looks like my coloring and foundation. Blend it in a little bit. See? It almost looks like it completely matches. So yay, that's a win. Can't wait to try it on. Next, I got an NYX Illuminator. The color is Enigmatic. It is IBB05. Looks like this. That is the color. Let's see here. How do we get into it? This is what the packaging looks like. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay. It's basically a highlighter. There. That shows more accurate the color because this looks really washed out. But it's more this pinky iridescent. We're going to see if it'll show up at all. See, it's like a pinky, pinky iridescent. Let me get a little bit more. It is a little powdery. So that's a bummer right here. So we'll have to use some um, setting spray with it. Next, I have NYX Cos Cosmic Metals. And this is a lip cream. The color is, let's see, it is called Celestial. So we are going, it looks like this. It's like a bronzy color. I'm going to try to get this off. You know, I should have been smart and opened all these packages first, but what's the fun in that? You guys don't get to see me struggle. All right. Doesn't have any kind of smell, really. Has a large doe foot applicator. We're going to put it right below. And see, it's this bronzy color. So that is super pretty. Just a nice bronze. Buffed it out a little bit more. And then, let's see what we got next. I picked up an NYX Turn Up Lipstick. This is in color Pink Lady. I'm going to open real quick. It looks like this. And it's like a peachy pink color. It is this pink right there. Very, very pretty. And then I believe I got another one. I think, yes, here it is. This is another NYX Turn Up Lipstick. And the color is Tangerine. And this is on it being tan. So let's see if we can get this open. These plat, I'm telling you what. Don't use your teeth at home, kids. 
Just because I do it, don't do it. All right. This one looks like this. Oops, sorry. And it is pretty tan. We're going to put that one right above the pink swatch. Can you see it right here? Maybe if I turn down my light some. Ooh, that's turning it up. It's right there. So that is a cute color, a nice nude. I was wondering if I turned down my coloring too much now. Okay, I'm just making sure I didn't get the same color twice. No, I didn't. This is an, another NYX Cosmic Metals Lip Cream. I got it in Speed of Light. We'll take it out of the packaging because I think that the light diffuses off of the packaging and then we can't see clearly what the color looks like. This is a coppery color. Very pretty. Ooh, another doe foot applicator, of course. Oh, I love it. Okay, I really like that one. It's right there. Very coppery, rose goldy type look. And then I got an NYX Professional Makeup Suede Matte Lip Liner. This is in Shanghai. Let's try to get this one open. These lip liners, the plastic is so small on them that it's hard to get off. Hmm. Well, y'all, my cap is stuck in my plastic, but I'll just have to get that later. Oh, this is a really pretty lip liner. Try and draw a good little swatch for you guys. It's there, right there. Very pretty. That could go with a lot of pinks. It's kind of a desert rosy color. Then I got another matte lip liner, the NYX Suede. This is called Cape Town. This is like a... Hold on. There we go. Gotta get it started. So, so elegant. Yuck. This is a good nude. Don't judge me. <laughs> oh, this would go nice with that um, tangerine. See, it's right there. Let's see. And I think, did I have another one? No, maybe not. No. All right. Then I got an NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. This is in Foiled Again. It is an orangey color, but I thought maybe for fall, or I was hoping it would be kind of sheer orange. This is what it looks like, you guys. We're going to find out together. I don't think it's going to be sheer at all. It has a nice doe foot. No. It's not sheer at all, friends. Maybe for the fall I could wing it out with something. I don't know. Look at that bright orange right there. Well, I'll play with it. I mean, it was throw it in the bag. Then I got a, another NYX. This is called Strictly Vinyl. The packaging is kind of funky, the plastic. So I'll have to take it off to see what the name of the color is. This is called Bad Girl. And look at how dark red it is. So we are going to try that. I love dark, dark red or berry colors. Oh, this is gorgeous. Kind of vampy though. I think it'll be cool for fall again. Right there. Look at that. That is so cool. I like that. All right. What are we moving on to next? And then I got an NYX Away We Glow Illuminating Powder. Looks like that. 
This is in the color Summer Reflection. Try to get it open real quick. I really think next time I'm going to go ahead and like get all the plastic off and all the sticky off so you guys don't have to sit here and wait for me. It looks like this. There. It has a pink, a coral, um, like a light gold color, and a champagne color. I'm going to mix them all together. Can you see it right here? It's very light since it's an illuminator. Then I got the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow Long Wear Powder in a Demi Glow. Looks like this. This is another um, item that will probably be hard to swatch because it is it's a highlighter. But it's a powder, so it'll give your skin a little bit of a glow, not much. So it won't be as easy to see like normal makeup. The bottom is a matte color. The top is a shimmer, if you guys can see that line down the middle. I'm going to try to... Try it out just a little bit. Right here under the orange, you guys can probably barely see it because it's a powder. And then underneath it has the little powder puff that you would put it on with. Next, I got two of these because they look super cool. They are ombre um, blushes. Both of them have been open, but I did not use either one. One I looked at, and the other, my little friend Caitlin, needed um, a mirror at our meeting because her make her mascara was malfunctioning. So look at that with the ombre. I'm so excited to finally swatch it. Oh my, this is very pigmented. Let's see, where are we going to put it? We're going to put it right here. Look at that, you guys. That is crazy pigmentation. We would have to go in with a very light hand for that. It's very purpley. So I got two of those, so those will be lasting me a while. And then the last thing I got, I thought this would be really cool for fall, of course, like Halloween time, and maybe putting a lip gloss over it. This is Maybelline Smoked Silver Metallic Lipstick. We're going to put some right here. Look at that gray. Wouldn't that be cool for fall or Halloween or put like a really cool like orangey um, gloss over it. I think it would be. So then that was all that I got in my bag. Hold on, I gotta take a drink. Hint water. I'm obsessed with you. You ever want to send your girl some hint water? I drink it. Cases fly by. Love it. Okay. So then they had this palette for $5. It is NYX Machinist. And the palette is called Grind. Get it out real quick. This is what it looks like. Very, very pretty. Those are the colors. I'm trying not to blind you with the mirror. So we are going to see if we can swatch them on the back of my arm. They do not have any names. I'm sorry to say. Can you guys see that color? I tell you, this lighting. It is a light, um, like greenish silver. 
this is a true green. Then we have a black. This is like a dandelion yellow color. Can you guys see it under there? Um, next is a rose gold color. Right here. The next one is like a very light peach. So I don't know if you guys are going to see it at all. I'll try to do a better swatch. It's right underneath that rose gold. These colors are not swatching very well at all. Then there's a light brown color. This one is a very a dark brown color. Let's see. Now we have like a satin green. That is not coming out very green. Let me try it again. Right here. It's not coming out very well. This is a color shifting one between green, blue, purpley, and brown. Right here. Then we have like a brick red color right underneath that, right there. And then this one is like a coppery color, coppery bronze, right there. So those are the swatches. Once again, that's the palette. So yeah, for $15, and then I got another I got the advent calendar from NYX, so I still got to get with Olivia for that, um, to open hers, because she bought one too, and we're going to go back and forth and open our days, so she wasn't feeling well the other day, unfortunately, so we didn't do it then, but we still have that um, that we want to do together, so those are the things that I got. I was really excited. Because some of these things, when it comes to drugstore makeup, um, I get kind of iffy about trying it sometimes because um, the, sometimes the quality is just not there. So I don't want to waste my money and then not be able to take things back and you know how that is. So I was really excited to go to this makeup sale and today's Sunday. Next Saturday on May 11th, they are having another one. So I may go and check it out, see if they have new makeup, different makeup. So I am super excited about that. It was a fun experience to go to. You know, these things don't happen every day. So it was really fun to go to. And then I wanted to let you guys know that right now, today is May 5th, um, Sunday, that as of right now, Forever 21 is having 50% off their clearance. So if you guys went over to my Instagram, it is Jamie down slash Susie, if you want to check it out and follow me. Um, I posted what I bought there. They also have Afterpay. I was getting pants and shorts for like $5, $7. So I bought a few things that I normally wouldn't buy for myself, but since they were so cheap, I kind of was wanting to try them out. So, yeah, as soon as that arrives, I will definitely be doing a video showing you how it fits, how it looks, and when I think about it. So, head over, don't walk, run to Forever 21 and pick up some good things. I will see you guys in my next video.